pause on the beats from the novels by Edgar Rice Burroughs. With Mr. James H. Pierce as Tarzan and Miss Joanne Burroughs as Jane Porter. This is an American Gold Seal production released by the World Broadcasting System and Associated States. Tarzan returns to his jungle after rescuing Professor Porter and his party from the cannibals because he cannot understand the code of the white. He finds his kingship of the apes disputed by Takla, a bull ape. But in a fierce battle, he defeats Takla and resumes his leadership of the tribe. Down at the seashore, in the meantime, the mutineers have landed, have attacked the white party of the hut, and are even now carrying away Jane Porter as a hostage. Now, are you ready? Hold your breath. Get out of this place. I never want to see it again. Oh, let me down. Let me go. Shut up. Stop your kicking. I'll go quietly. If you'll only let me walk. We'll make better time if we let her walk. Never shouting to our friends back there at the yacht. I won't shout. I promise. Well, we can hold a gun on her back. And then if she hollers, we can... Ah, uh, that's right. The way we are going, it will take us till daylight to get out of sight of that hut. Oh, all right. Now, listen to me. If you make one fire shouting... I'll blow your blooming head off. I, I won't. All right. Here's how you don't. Come on. I I suppose you know that the moment they find out that I'm gone, Lieutenant Dano and the others will come to your camp. What does I care about that? Long before they even wakes up, you'll have told us all we want to know. But, but I can't... You I... ain't telling me nothing. And even if you don't, we can always go back and get your old man. He'll talk... Or I'll kill him. And what's more, we ain't going to the camp so that they can start searching any time they want to. Oh, yeah. We got a nice place all figured out. Nice and quiet it is. Ain't no danger from nobody finding us. But, but you can't keep me forever. We ain't going to. <laughs> we got all our plans by we as. We take your board ship. Then, if you don't talk, well, when we get tired of you, some dark night, we chuck you overboard. Oh, yeah. We got it all figured out. Oh, you beast. Our words ain't gonna help you none. Yeah, we are. In you go, gal. Oh, into that black hole. Oh, it's only a cave. There's plenty of room inside. We're going to sit down, and we're going to ask a question. If anybody comes and tries any shooting, well, we got you where we want you. Oh, there's no use asking questions. I don't know anything about the treasure. That's what you said her for. Try something else for a change. Oh, how can I tell you where any treasure is when I know nothing about it? Maybe you don't, and maybe you does. If you does, you talk. And if you don't, you're just older here. So some of your friends makes up their minds to talk. My friends don't know any more than I do. I've been with... We've been prisoners in a cannibal village for weeks. None of us has ever seen the treasure. Oh, no? Then who moved the treasure? Tell us that. But can't you understand? We didn't know it had been moved. We didn't know you had even found the original spot where it was buried. Yes, we found it right enough. When that blasted, stretchy cruiser comes, we had to hide it again. Well, couldn't someone else besides us have found it? Ain't nobody else but you and your friends that know about it. Why not? You had to hide it from the Frenchman on the cruiser, didn't you? Right, you gal. You know too much by art. I think you know where the stuff is. Ah, rat snipes. It's as plain as the nose on your face that as dame don't know nothing about it. I ain't inclined to believe that. This here gal was the one that had the map to start with. Well, what about them Frenchies? And all them might have found her at that. And if they did, we owe the light a year until they give it up. Well... It ain't so long till daylight. King, here. Back you goes to the up. See? Tell them blokes as how he has the lighting. Tell them to kick through with the info we want. And to kick through quick. What? 
We'll go back to that hut and get shot. <laughs> Not on your life. Oh. So, you ain't taking orders, eh? No. Not them kind of orders, I ain't. Oh. Well, look after our lady friend here, Arthamo. While I convince this king as how we ought to go when I tell him. No, wait just a minute, Sight. I ain't minute. doing no listening, and I ain't doing no more talking. I'm going to count three. And if you ain't on your way, I shoot. No, no, look here, Sight. One. It's, it's two. And go. Oh, I'm going. Don't shoot. Meanwhile, Tarzan, swinging his way through the upper jungle terrace, draws closer to the hut in the clearing. The ape man's raid on the cannibal village has resulted in a supply of arrows that will last him for some time, but it is not of that that he's thinking. He thinks now of Jane Porter there at the hut, waiting for him. Tarzan, though he cannot always express himself, knows that Jane Porter likes him, and for himself, he puzzles over the feeling that he has for Jane. No one but the long-dead Kayla had ever shown any affection for the ape-man. Tarzan, as he passes through the leafy trail, tries to find a reason for the strange emotion which possesses him. All about, the jungle stirs to life. The chirping of birds, the screeching of parrots, the distant roar of the jungle beasts blends into the subdued hum that is the jungle noise by day. By Lord Greystoke, Philander awakens as the jungle dawn shows through the latticed window. <sighs> Anybody awake? Uh, oui, monsieur. I am. So am I. Oh. Oh. Professor's still sleeping soundly. Mm, and the fever seems to be gone, too, thank goodness. I, I say, what the deuce? What is it, monsieur? The door is not. The locking bar is not in place, eh? Well, Francois is outside. Jane? Uh, Francois? Monsieur? Is Miss Porter out there with you? Mais non, monsieur, non. Uh, uh, Jane? Uh, Jane! Uh, 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 what is it? Oh, oh yes, uh, did someone speak? Easy, Clayton. Don't wait, the Professor. Uh, what is it? What is it? Uh, what is the matter? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Just, um... Just seeing if you were awake, that's all. Uh, Adano, outside. You say, Francois, that Miss Jane did not come out? Mais non, monsieur. Not since I have been here. And that is more than one hour. And the locking bar, was that in place when you came out? Mais non, mon lieutenant. I thought it strange, but I did not wish to wake anybody. Then Jane must have left of her own free will. She may be with Tarzan. That's... Just uh, She is, Monsieur Clayton. I would not worry. Oh, I know how you feel, but then But, you... Dano, suppose she isn't with Tarzan. But, Monsieur, where else could she be? Snipes and his gang of cutthroats. Oh, mon Dieu. But, but the door cannot be opened from the outside. And anyway, they could not have entered and taken Mademoiselle Jane from behind the partition without some noise. No, no, Monsieur, I am possible. Archimedes is asking for Jane. Do you think she might have gone away with Tarzan? Just what I was saying, Monsieur Philodier. Well, I don't know. Oh, dash it. Jane wouldn't have gone off with her father as sick as he is. During the excitement caused by Jane's absence, Tarzan arrives at the hut. Francois sees him. Look, come in, Francois. Tarzan. Oh, Monsieur Tarzan, have you seen Jane? Jane? Seen Jane? No, I, I came here to see her. Monsieur Monsieur Clayton, it appears that you have the right of it. We must go at once. Francois! Where is Jane? We don't know. Don't know? Don't know where Jane is? No. When we got up just a few moments ago, she was gone. Gone? 
Tarzan does not understand. During the night, she must have left the hut. We thought perhaps she had gone with you, Tarzan. You let her go alone? But cannot you see? We did not let her go. She went without our knowledge. You've got one, two, three, four men here, and you let Jane go. Well, I do not understand. But, Tarzan, if Mademoiselle Jane left the hut, she must have had very good reason. Jane not go herself. Armand Gani, come, take Jane. Yes, yes. That is what Monsieur Clayton suggested. But come, we waste time. Let us go. Go where? To the camp of these mutineers of assurity. Tarmangani camp. But Tarmangani not there. Not there? What do you mean? I came past Tarmangani camp on way here. No more Tarmangani stop there. Great Scott, man. You don't mean what you're saying. But, monsieur, we must do something. We must go. No, you stay. Tarzan, go find Jane. But you don't know any more than we do. Where, where will you go, Tarzan? Tarzan, go into trees. Listen. Jungle beast, tell him where find Tarmangani. Good, good, splendid. You Tarmangani let mutineers steal Jane. Tarzan, go now. Find Jane, quick. Right, Tarzan. And when you find her, call. And we follow. Will Tarzan arrive in time to save Jane from torture by the pirates? 